President of the European Commission, José Manuel Barroso, warned on Wednesday that political instability is the biggest risk to Europe's future. He attacked his Eurosceptic critics and called for a stronger European Union. Addressing the European Parliament in what most likely will be his last State of the Union speech, Barroso urged EU leaders to continue implementing reforms as the bloc slowly leans towards economic recovery. There are those who claim that a weaker Europe will make their country stronger, that Europe is a burden, they will be better off without it. My reply is clear. We all need a Europe that is united, strong and open. In the debate that is ongoing all across Europe, the bottom line question is, do you want to improve Europe or give it up? My answer is clear. Let's engage. If you don't like Europe as it is, improve it. Find ways to make it stronger, internally and internationally, and you will have in me the firmest of supporters. Find ways that allow for diversity without creating discriminations, and I will be with you all the way. But don't turn away from it. I believe a political union needs to be our political horizon, as I stressed in last year's State of the Union. This is not just demand of a passionate European. This is an indispensable way forward to consolidate our progress and ensure the future. Barroso devoted part of his speech to defend the Union's answer to the crisis, as more and more citizens across Europe blame Brussels for their national economic problems. He argued that the austerity measures taken in debt-ridden countries are now starting to have a positive effect, but MEPs warned that the crisis is not over yet. These first signs of recovery are more the proof of the fact that we hit the bottom of the recession. The bottom of the recession and that means that we enter in what I call a second phase of this crisis. I think it's far too easy only to see uh, the negative points, as has been done a few minutes ago. I think it's also not fair only to see the positive signs and say, OK, uh, it's over now, we are going up again, that it's not true. What we in fact see is a second phase in this crisis. After nine years in office as head of the European Commission, Barroso's fourth address in Strasbourg could be his last, as his mandate comes to an end in May 2014.